game, as I said, shooting 33% from threes, and they just hit 9 of 15 on Saturday. Well, I thought we played very good defense, too. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're better off letting, you know, backing off. Maybe they'll think about it. But I really think uh, Georgia Tech just was sensational. I can't believe that team's lost seven games in the conference play. Mm -hmm. And you don't, if they play that way, they're going to lose many more, period. Coach, and we're going to take a look at those highlights now. The Tar Heels against Georgia Tech. The Smith Center on Saturday afternoon, North Carolina against Georgia Tech. Turned out to be a great basketball game, Coach, but Georgia Tech was throwing them in. It really was. We are throwing them in, too. That's why it had to be a great game for ABC Television. Or I guess it was ABC National. Great pass inside, Derek Clark to Eric Montross. And there's one of our open. Look how open our threes are. And... Uh, I really think we had a hand up on most of their threes, but that's the way it goes sometimes. Good pitch ahead. We out. We got down the court quickly. Donald Williams, nice to have him back shooting the open three and doing it well. Another great steal. There he goes in for the dunk, and then wisely he sees Bess is the only one there, so he picks him up and gets another steal here and makes a tough shot. A nice four-point play. There's George Lynch, uh, of course, with Kenny Smith. George and uh, Matt Winston, uh, Hubert Davis, all here from the pro break. Eric Montrash ran. Dante Calabria came up with five steals. That was one of them. And we're, watch this drive of Bryant's. How does he get in there? I don't know. I want to do it more often, and he did it well. Again, wide open. Wide open. Uh, there, Dante has a good look. Even your wide open, you don't always make those. There's Donald, gets another good look. 37-22. And then that one was covered, but Jeff McKenna still made the three. They still had more threes than we did. Right before the half, great double team. They're going for the last shot. 48-41, Coach Carolina leads it at halftime. And we played well enough to be even more than that, but Dante played to a good rear screen, force running down, but we got our layup. And Dante, now that one was covered. He still made a three. And that was open. We ran at him, but he stayed, Fred Vincent stayed behind. He really had some day. Nice move by Jerry Stackhouse. And it's kind of back and forth here. They're jamming Eric. Derek makes a three. 68-64, Carolina. A lot of scoring left to be done. We're still up. Pretty play. Good pass inside. Dante gets it in there, Rashid. Good basket. Forrest uh, has long arms. He's supposed to be 6'8", but he went up with him a lot. There, a good rebound. Big one. Got us within 75-72, Carolina. Right. Right. And watch this. What a great shot by Forrest. That's what you're about one, Coach. And then we go up one with Derek here. Right. Derek taking it to the basket. I like our shot. I like the shots we had down the line. And that the clock was going down. Travis Best hit that by Dante Calabria. Georgia Tech goes on to win it, 96-89 at the Smith Center. Carolina basketball highlights brought to you by Gatorade. The Tar Heels 20-4 overall, 8-3 in the Atlantic Coast Conference. We're going to come back and meet Tar Heel Pierce Landry and former Carolina player Larry Brown after this from First Union. 